A very good day to all of you. Welcome to this class of science. Dear students, today we are going to learn something very interesting. Before I introduce my topic, I need your help. Please identify the profession of following people. Get ready and let's start. Doctor, nurse, policeman, teacher. Now, who is he? Yes, he is a farmer. Can you tell me what a farmer do? He grows crop for us. Here, I have some good pictures. of various crops dear students today we are going to start our topic crop production and management let us look around and think what crops are think about the plants that we see in our garden or we have in our houses or in a farmer field is there any difference between plants of a garden and plants of a farmer's field the plants that we see in the garden are of different types but the plants that we see in a field are of same type which is known as crop What do you understand by the term crop? When plants of same kind are grown and cultivated at one place on a large scale it is called crop. We have different variety of crops like cereals, vegetables and fruits. Why there is so much variety of crops? Because the climatic conditions like temperature, rainfall, humidity vary from one place to another. Now we have two different cropping patterns on the basis of seasons. in which they are grown rabi crop kharif crop rabi crop they are grown in winter season from october to march these crops are also known as winter crop some examples of rabi crops are wheat barley tea Kharif crops. They are grown in rainy season from June to September. These crops are also called rainy crops. Some examples of kharif crops: rice, maize, cotton, and groundnut. Now, I have a question. For you, why paddy cannot be grown in winter seasons? Because it is a kharif crop, which is grown in rainy season. Now, be ready for an interesting quiz. You have to identify the type of crop. Rabi crop. और खरीफ क्रॉप राइस वीट कॉटन पी ग्राम मेज नाउ यू कैन चेक योर आंसर्स
Agriculture is not as simple as growing a plant or sapling in our balcony or garden. It involves a number of processes to grow a successful crop. The activities undertaken by farmers for cultivation of crops are called agricultural practices. First step is preparation of soil. Second, selection and sowing of seeds. Third, adding manure and fertilizers. Fourth, irrigation. Fifth, protecting from weeds. Sixth, harvesting. And last is storage. This picture shows all agricultural practices that are undertaken by farmers. What we have learned today? Crop Plants of the same kind grown and cultivated at one place on a large scale. Two cropping patterns Rabi crops and Kharif crops. Rabi crop grown in winter season, for example, wheat, barley, pea, and gram. Kharif crop grown in rainy season, for example, rice, cotton, maize, and groundnut. Agricultural practices activities undertaken by a farmer for cultivation of crops. Home Assignment Question number 1. Define crop. Question number 2. Wheat is sown in the Kharif season. What would happen? Discuss. Question number 3. Give two examples of Rabi crops and Kharif crops. Question number 4. What is the difference between Rabi crop and Kharif crop? Discuss with your parents and grandparents about different types of crops grown in different parts of country. Dear students, we will learn all agricultural practices in our next video. Thank you and have a nice day to all.